Alrighty, all you Red Dogs fans, Red Dog Nations, we're here at Tomino's Memorial Day Barbecue for the Dog Pound. I am Rick Franceschino, starting left fielder and voice of the Red Dogs. I am joined by my co-host, Roy Franceschino here, third base coach. Uh, How does it feel to be uh, at Tomino's for the Memorial Day Barbecue? It's, it's awesome. It's a once-in-a-lifetime experience. You know, we look forward to to it um, every year, and it's just been a blast so mm -hmm. far. It's, it's been great. And you know what? The thing we love about this, guys, is we actually have a live audience for the first time. Yeah. There we go. We got the fans out there. They're really enjoying it. Um, so we got a great dog pound set up for you guys today. We got a, a all-star uh, lineup of interviews coming your way just to get you a little bit more uh, info on our, our, our players here. So um, I believe we have... We do have Zimmer outside for the uh, weather update. I know uh, he's outside, out there, so we're going to go uh, cut live to him out there in the weather. Thank you, Rick. I'm standing out here, and as you can tell, it is a beautiful day for our barbecue. If you can see, we got games going on. All right. And uh, we're we're just we're gonna bring it back to you. All righty, Zim. It looks like you're having a fun time out there. With the it looks like the weather's going great. Uh, I know Roy. Last week you were coming off of the injury. As you can see, he's still uh in the leg brace there. Um, how's it? How's the leg feel so far? Uh, still feels really shitty. Um, as you can see, I'm still in this brace, so. Mm -hmm. Having a hard time getting around. I'm just uh, waiting on the uh, doctors to call me any minute now. Set up probably when we're gonna do surgery. So um, you know, I'm just waiting on that call. So mm -hmm. I might have to step out at some point here. Okay, sounds good. Sounds good. So, like I said, we have a lot of updates here coming out. We uh, we have an interview with our starting third baseman Weimer. Uh, we have him coming up. After him, we have uh, Mangerson, the pitcher. Uh, and then we have uh, Tomito coming out to wrap up all those interviews. So we're really looking forward to all the great interviews. Right uh, here, I got that call. So I'm gonna get, step out here for a second. Okay? okay. Yeah. So, so like I said, we have a uh, a great episode coming out there. Zimmer just updated us on the weather. It looks like he's having a good time out there. Uh, so we're really happy that the weather could work out work out in our favor. Um, so, uh, like I said, we have uh, I think we have Weimer coming up soon. Uh, he's holding on deck right now as uh, as we wait. And okay, thank you, uh, Tamino, our first baseman. I've actually just gotten terrible news. Uh, there's been some kind of accident outside. Um, we don't know much at this point, but it appears that Roy has been injured in some kind of attack. Uh, we, we don't know the details yet. We'll uh, we'll give them to you right away. Um, so. Filling in, I think we have. I think we have Zimmer going to come in and, and fill in for him, um, uh, just to kind of take his spot. Uh, the show must go on, so we're we're just going to go on without Roy. We'll give you updates the more we know. Um, I know we have some people out there with him right now, um, so like I said, the more we know, we'll give that information out to you. But right now, I'm joined by uh, Zimmer. He's going to take in Roy's spot for the rest of the episode. Uh, Zimmer, can you introduce yourself to the Red Dog Nation? Everybody, uh, you know, our former starting catcher, Matt Zimmer here, uh, current, uh, I, you know, I ride the bench and I just provide moral support. A absolutely sad uh, what happened to Roy. I, I, I hope we can get an update on him later. Yeah. That would, yeah. yeah, that would be great. That would be good. So um, we're going to go straight to our first interview now. Uh, we have Matthew Weimer uh, going to come in and take our first interview. Uh, like I said, these interviews are more of a get-to-know-your-players type thing. I know we did a dog pound earlier in the week uh, that kind of previewed everything so here we are starting third baseman uh matthew weimer as he sits down and gets some of the uh gets the equipment on and everything this should be a good one i like this oh yeah i feel, I feel weimer welcome to the broadcast table thanks matt thanks rick you, um, you're out of the shot a little bit. Out of the shot. Get in the shot. shot. Get in the shot. A little bit. There we'll we go. We'll get him. We don't have a line. We don't have a line. We don't have a lot of room over here with the big third baseman. You coming. said it. So uh, Matthew Weimer, you've had a, a hot start to the year, starting on fire. Your uh, your batting statistics are through the roof. Um, is there any pregame rituals you do before the uh, game to get yourself psyched up for these things? <sighs> Not really. I just. Uh, I throw the ball around a little bit, but mm -hmm. you guys have your own sort of things going on. Mm -hmm. I kind of stay away from that as much as I can. 
You guys kind of distract me, so I just kind of stay off to the side. And do your own thing. I, absolutely, because <laughs> i got to get my head in the game right away. You guys, mm -hmm. I don't know what you guys are doing, but it kind of distracts me from what I want to do uh, before the game. Mm -hmm. yeah, a lot of shenanigans. A lot of shenanigans. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I, I just want—I want to point out your attire today. Maybe you stand up and give the fans a little bit of a look here. You got the the America shirt. Oh boy. The America pants. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Deck that. You get the bandana too. Exactly. Yeah. You're looking good today. I, I want to bring it up. Uh, how, how many deep are you today here? In this the beer will game? be number ten. That's um, number ten. Number ten. Wow. wow. <laughs> okay, so you're enjoying yourself and you're having a good time here. Where am I? <laughs> at, at, the, at the annual Camino Memorial Barbecue. You're having a good time? You say so. All right. Uh, okay. Yeah. It's terrific. Good. Yeah. Good times. It, it sound, sounds like you're having a good time here. So, oh, oh yeah. Time. So, yeah. So like I said, you've been on fire. You're batting over an 800 on bases over an 800. Uh, great start to the season. Is there anything that you need to do to keep the momentum going throughout the rest of this year? Well, batting in the tool, it's, it's important for me to get on base for the guys behind me. Um, if you guys don't have anybody on base, it's hard for guys like AJ. Zach and Jason to knock uh, get some RBIs and you know that happened to us last game you know we, we needed somebody on base mm -hmm. I, I let off the inning and took I don't like taking walks but I got to do what I got to do and uh, Jason ended up hitting a three run homer so mm -hmm. anything I can do to help the guys behind me it's you know it's important mm -hmm. definitely so, sounds good yep. yeah um now now we we found out that uh your roommate and very close friend Chad had, had just moved out um, I'm wondering, does it affect your game at all? Is it gonna, you know, gonna take that with you on the field, or are you leave that behind? Well, it was devastating, to say the least. Um, you know, he's a Packers fan. He moved to Milwaukee. That's his own business. But mm -hmm. you know, I miss him terribly. It's been three days. I'm not gonna say I haven't cried myself to sleep, but it's happened at least once. Yeah, it's, I, I understand. Totally yeah. understand. Yeah. yeah. Well, when a, when a person like that leaves your life, it really is hard. And we try to not let it affect us on the field, um, but sometimes it. Well, it's happens. affecting me. I'm gonna say it's yeah, affecting right. me. And, and Chad, if you're watching out there, uh, we're gonna miss you, buddy. Mm -hmm. Hope you can come Definitely. down soon. Be great. We're, we're, we'd love to come visit you as well. And if you want to come down to join us uh, and watch some of our Red Dogs games, feel free. Mm -hmm. Absolutely Any, free. Anytime. Anytime. Absolutely free. Anytime. Um, Absolutely. So thank you for your time, Weimer. Uh, we look forward to seeing you out on the field this coming Sunday against Man Bear Puigs. Um, mm -hmm. We appreciate the time. Uh, have a couple more beers. Enjoy yourself. I Always a pleasure, sir. Always a pleasure. Yeah. Matt Rick, thanks a lot. Starting third baseman Matthew Weimer uh, exiting the dog pound. Really glad that he can be on us. Uh, let's hear it for Matthew Weimer, everybody. <laughs> great, 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 great human great. being, a better third baseman. So, um, we just got word on uh, Roy, just to give you guys an update. Uh, Can't they do the headset. Yep, yeah, they are still waiting on first responders out there. So uh, right now, he's still waiting for the first responders. The more we know, we'll let you know. Um, but we're going to go into our next interview at this point. We're going to go to our uh, starting pitcher, which is uh, Mangerson. Uh, so he's going to come no, out. No, no, no. The not, starting not, this year is not even pick up. This year. This year. Yeah, okay. Come on. This what do you got? Uh, James Pickett, yeah, everybody. Yeah, James all right, Pickham, all right, all right. Uh, Here we go. The right center fielder. Here we go. Here we go. We got the right person in now. There right, we go. We got right. Mangerson now. So we have starting pitcher uh, Matthew uh, Mangerson with us. Not not Weimer. Uh, Ma Mangerson, welcome to the table. Thank you. Thank, thank you. Thank, thank you for joining the dog pound with us. As we have Mangerson. So Mangerson, you uh, started last year and previous years in left field, and this is the first time that you're going to be pitching this year. Uh, we started two and zero. Uh, how do you feel coming off those those double hitter? Double head win uh, in the opening day. You know, it felt good. You know, uh, it was a little, little different. You know, switching from left field into the pitching spot. Mm -hmm. But you know what? You know, I, I, I did a little pitching back in uh, eighth grade when I played softball too. So mm -hmm. I, it, you know, just got right back on that wagon. Everything mm -hmm. went very smoothly. We took our first two games, and uh, you know, I, th I think I showed why uh, I should be on that mound now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so you. It, we looked really good behind you. Everything was very confident. Um, but we have a challenging game ahead of us against Man Bear Peaks. So three and zero. Now you've been off the past two weeks. Yes. As we yes. know, you were on vacation two weeks ago, and then we had Memorial Day break. Yep. Now with those two weeks off, do you think it's going to be a tougher challenge coming in uh, next week? You know, I, I really don't. You know, I've I've had those two weeks to rest up the arm. You know, it feels mm -hmm. great. You know, got a lot of ice on it. You know, uh, feels great. I'm hoping uh, to to hopefully throw um, a shutout. Mm -hmm. Actually, you know what? I'm, I'm feeling confident. 
I, I think it, we can take this as a shutout. Mangerson, is that a guarantee? Are you guaranteeing the Red Dogs Nation that you will pitch a shutout this coming Sunday against the 3-0 Mangerson? That Man is Leafs? a guarantee. I'm saying it here on no. the dog pile. Um, there we, there wow. we go, Red, Red Dog Nation. A, we have, Red dog we have the Bears, exclusive yeah. here. Mangerson is Woo. guaranteeing a shutout against that the 3-0 uh, Man Bear Puigs. This coming Sunday, it's gonna come back on your heart if it doesn't go well. I'm gonna. You know what? You know what? I am feeling confident. I've had the two weeks rest. This is happening. Okay. Great. All right. Great. Now I know uh, Zimmer. You had a couple questions uh, for yeah. Anderson. Uh, I see you brought the, the wife and daughter out today. Yes. Yes. They yes. did come uh, by. Yes. Ha- they, they're coming has, to show some support. Has becoming a father affected your game at all? Has you know what? In, it it hasn't. Um, I think it's actually um, made me um, love the game even more. Okay. You know, I'm going to teach yeah. it to her. So, you know what? I'm going out there trying to play even harder. Show her, you know, what I can do. Mm-hmm. Okay, you're right. You're trying to prove yourself. Exactly. Keep right. it in the family. Keep it in the family. Keep it in the family. Yeah. Carrying that tradition yeah. on. I love it. Maybe someday she becomes a star pitcher herself. Exactly. Yep. Yeah. Okay, mm-hmm. I can see that. Yeah. Uh, we, all, we also have word. You had spoken earlier. Um, with the new house and all, there would be a, a home, a house warning barbecue. Like yes, that. yes, we are planning something. We don't, we don't have a specific date yet. There okay. will be a barbecue at the new house okay. to celebrate. Uh, two further questions with that: uh, Will the Red Dogs be sponsoring this barbecue? You know what? I have not run it by everybody at mm-hmm. the Red Dogs. Got to um, talk to manager. Lanny. Yes, I will have right, to talk to manager. Yeah. And um, also, get that clear. Uh, will the weather be similar to this? You know what? It, if it's similar to this, I think it would be turned out to be a great day because you saw okay, how great right. the weather is for Barbara right, today. Right. You know what? We were having fun out exactly. there. Exactly. You, you, you threw yeah. that frisbee. You know, we're having fun out there. You know? Great. Um, absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah, so it would be great if we got the same weather we did today. Yeah, it would be great. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. So we will keep the Red Dog Nation updated on that that news. Uh, that would be great if we can have the Red Dogs get invited to that the barbecue. That'd be oh, great. definitely. Yes, fantastic. yes. It okay. be, we expect that. And hopefully, you know, when we have that, we'll still be undefeated. Mm-hmm. Hopefully, hopefully, but we will see that this coming Sunday against the 3-0 Man Bear Puigs. Uh, 3-0 Red Dogs versus 3-0 Man Bear Puigs. It's going to be a tough challenge, but we have Mangerson taking the mound. I have full confidence in him. Uh, thank you, Mangerson, for, for joining us on awesome. the Dog awesome. Pound. It's been a pleasure. Great to have uh, we you. hope you enjoy the rest of the time. I know you got to take little baby home. Yes, yes, yes. I will be back, though. I will be back to uh, continue the festivities here with the Red Dogs. All right. Fantastic. We're Fantastic. Gonna, we're going to have some hot dogs ready for you. Yeah? We, we All certainly right. will. Thank you. Thank, thank you, Matthew you. Weimer. Thank Everyone, you. not Matthew Weimer, oh, Mangerson. Oh, oh my God. Up. I'm this sorry. guy. <laughs> yeah. This guy. You know, let me tell you. Thank you, Mangerson. It's been a it's pleasure. It's our first live broadcast. I, you know what? Pop, the nerves are going. You still give yourself a little bit. We are We are getting an update right now. We are. If you'd like to if you'd like to let the fans know. Yeah, we are. So the first responders have come by. Uh, they picked up Roy. They're going to take him into the ambulance right now to Payless Hospital. We don't quite know how serious the injury is. We don't know if it was the knee again or some other other issue. Uh, we do have word there there was there was someone out there with him. Mm-hmm. They ran. We don't know who we they ran know. off. Um, we, we hopefully Roy anymore. maybe caught a glimpse of them. We don't know. We don't, uh, we don't know the details. We, right. We will get the info to you as soon as we have it. As soon as we have it. But um, have So it. just a little update on Roy for you there. Uh, we're going to go to our last interview, which is our starting first baseman and host today of the barbecue. Uh, Jonathan Tomino is going to join us on the Dog Pound, everybody. <laughs> Woo! It's a pleasure to have uh, John Tomino starting you first baseman with us. As you can have a seat. Get yourself a headset. Get yourself comfortable. All right, boys. Well, How's well, it going? Well, How's it going, Rick? It's welcome. good seeing you. Welcome. Well, first off, I want to thank you, absolutely thank you for uh, hosting this Memorial Day barbecue. Not a uh, problem. It's a real flabber of a barbecue. Absolutely you know what? Fantastic. Every year every year, I like to throw out this uh, this uh, Memorial Day barbecue. Mm-hmm. Obviously, uh, it all goes to charity, mm-hmm. uh, which is which is wonderful. My organization, um, if anyone wants to look it up, <laughs> www.tunarocks.com. Uh, and then go ahead, then go ahead and donate. Com. So please, everyone out there, go that's ahead and donate. Tunarocks.com. Yeah. Tunarox.com. And that's T U N A R O X. dot com. Yeah. Yeah. Remember the X, not the C K. Okay. So thank you for having us. I know the weather is cooperating very well with us. Oh, this. I mean, this is what I look forward to every year. This is my. This is my dream. This is my goal. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, people out here having a good time. So. Mm-hmm. Nice. So, nice. so I know we got a big game coming up. Uh, so we want to ask you a couple questions about sure. that. Sure. So this year you've decided to change your number to number fourteen. Uh, yes. We want to know a little bit more about that. Is it because of Paul Canerco retiring? Ooh, well, there's a lot of controversy about that. You know, the uh, the Red Dogs are kind of split half and half between Cubs fans, Sox fans. Mm-hmm. And, uh, you know, uh, I go with the Ernie Banks side. So mm-hmm. Ernie Banks, God rest his soul, 
uh, you know, passed away this past this past winter. Yeah. Uh, so fair I decided fair to fair put fair. the one four on mm -hmm. uh, in memory of him. You know, Paul Canerco's okay. He he did his job at first. Kind of slow, uh, not much on the defense, mm -hmm. but I respect what he did offensively. Mm -hmm. um, uh, but yeah, it was more for Ernie Banks. Okay. It okay. Ernie Banks. It's good to clarify that for the Red Dog yeah. Nation out yeah. there, uh, for Ernie Banks, not Falconer. Okay. Um, um, I want to ask you. I don't know if you if you've seen earlier. I was out there. I gave the weather report. Uh, as you can see, lovely weather outside. Mm -hmm. My, uh, my question mm -hmm. is, why today? Why not last week when it was like 80 outside and clear? Uh, why? Why today? Right. 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 Good question. Good question. Well, you know, in all honesty, um, you know, my boy out there in right center, Mr. Pickham. Uh, he's been having a tough time making the transition from pitcher to right center field. Mm -hmm. So you know, uh, I was you know he told me he wouldn't be able to make the Memorial Day party if it wasn't last week, and that just devastated me, mm -hmm. broke Absolutely. my heart. Uh, Mr. Yeah. Pickham, if he's out there, love him. Not, yeah, it not be, old it Mr. Be a president. Pickham, not Mr. President, not the president. Pickham, Pickham. No, 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 right, yeah. right. Uh, yeah, so you know, I thought yeah. I would throw him a bone. Uh -huh. uh, One of these. Exactly, you know, make him feel a little better, lift his yeah. spirits. Mr. Okay. Mangerson's been doing a hell of a job. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, me over there at first, I get to see what Mangerson's all about. It's just incredible. Uh, no disrespect to Mr. Pickham, mm -hmm. but, but, uh, but you know, I, I wanted him to be here. Yes, uh, absolutely. To, yeah. to, 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 to enjoy the festivities. And, and, and that's yeah. absolutely It'd be very important. Yeah. Yeah. Very respectful. Yeah. So, this week we are, it's a battle for first place against the Man Bear Pleaser at uh, What do you think the Red Dogs need to do? To pull out the W. Oh, good question. Good question. Uh, well, you know, we've had some uh, some great offensive games, and we've yeah. had some sloppy yeah. offensive games. We've had some great mm -hmm. defensive games. We've had some yeah. sloppy defensive mm -hmm. games. Basically, you know, we need to bring it all together. Mm -hmm. You know, we need to Absolutely. become a team. We need to put all of our egos aside. There's a lot of big bats Beauty. out there. there There's Beauty. a lot of uh, mm -hmm. great defensive players out there who can flash the leather, no problem. Yeah, no problem. And uh, you know, we just got to uh, work as a team, mm -hmm. really. You know, and I think okay. we can be. We've all been together for basically around five years now, mm -hmm. and uh, it's just putting it all together. That team bond is already yeah. there. Oh, it's yeah. there. It's there. Yeah. Um, I, I want to get on my last question here. Sure. Uh, in previous years. Uh, we've seen you get a little crazy here at these at these barbecues. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. Um, mm -hmm. My question is: Will you be heading to bed early tonight? Or are you going to make mm. it the long run? Are you going to go coast mm. to coast? Mm. Well, you know the the, the Blackhawks are on at uh, seven o'clock, mm -hmm. right. so I got to stay up past end. that, which okay. is kind of the it's goal so right the now. That's the goal. Yeah, that's okay. the goal is to get maybe at least into the third period. Um, depending what they're doing, I'll try and stay up. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, I don't have a dog to take care of. God rest his soul, Buster. I know you're up there. Um, uh, but yeah, I mean, we're gonna see. We're gonna play it out. I know mm -hmm. Mr. Weimer said he was about eight, nine beers in. I think I'm around seven or eight. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm always, I'm always trying to catch Mr. Weimer. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I'll ever get there. We're but, making that push. But yeah. we'll see. We'll All see. All right, we're gonna make that push. Yeah. So, Tamina, we'd like to thank you once again for hosting the Memorial Day party. My pleasure. We will. Awesome. Is there? Will there be one next year? Oh, there will always be a Memorial Day party. Uh, hopefully. We can do it outside of the garage. I mean, I love seeing my name right up there, but you know, Beautiful. outdoors grilling. That's what I'd like to do. So hopefully next year we'll get there. So come we'll next there. year, the Dog Pound will be making a return again to Tamino's annual Memorial Day yes, barbecue. Definitely. We'd like to thank okay, you for the thank time. You. Thank, thank you for you. joining thank us. You boys. Thank hey, you, boys. Hey, if you hear from Rick, please give him my best. No, I hope that's Rick. That's I hope Rick. if you hear from Roy, Roy. give him my <laughs> best. Roy. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I hope. I hope he pulls through. Live TV. Live TV. Live TV. So I hope he pulls through. Things are gonna happen. All right. Have a good night, Tamino. Everybody. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. All right, two starting, hands. starting first baseman, absolutely phenomenal guy, good softball player, better yeah. human yeah. being, yeah. just a great person. Um, all around, all and, around. And, and you know, I know he did give the shout out to Roy there to uh, on a quick and speedy recovery, but we just got word again. We did get uh, word. He was on his way to Payless Hospital. Mm -hmm. All the beds were full. Uh, they're gonna take him to Rush Hospital downtown. I know Ooh. it's a farther drive. That's a trip. Um, they, so they could chopper him in, though. They, it could be a little they, quicker. Yeah. They could. So um, as of right know. now, once they get him to Rush Hospital, they'll get him in the ER, try to fix him up as best as they can. At this extent, we don't know uh, the seriousness of his injury. Mm -hmm. We do know it's just mm -hmm. it's it's absolutely terrible. Yeah. Um, but we'd like to thank you guys for tuning in to another edition, a special edition of the Dog Pound at John Tomino's Memorial Day Barbecue. We look forward to seeing you guys tomorrow, this week, against Man Bear Puigs, the 3-0 Man Bear Puigs. It'll be a battle for first place, as you know. Um, we look forward to seeing you guys out there. Tickets are absolutely free 
free. So, 100%. You don't C5. have to pay a dime to come to these games. Absolutely not. So, the game will be at Centennial 5. Start time is uh, 6.30, I believe. 6.30, 6.30. Yeah, correct. We will put uh, the information on the Red Dogs Network, so look forward to that. But uh, we appreciate you guys coming in and joining us on the Dog Pound. Uh, I'd say it's been another successful episode. What would you say, Zimmer? I mean, other than Roy getting hurt, yes. Mm -hmm. And I want to thank Zimmer for coming in, uh, no filling problem. in for Roy. I know he had a little bit of issue, uh, so we will see Not you maybe in future broadcasts, possibly. Yeah, absolutely. Roy, uh, we're, we're hoping for you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We're going to end it on the, uh, the fans here. The many, the many fans out there. There we go, guys. Absolutely great episode. We'll see you guys this Sunday.